everyone welcome back to my channel after a year um today we are at la patisserie it is in in zambia i believe opposite to something more i will write it somewhere down there and i'm here for breakfast with my friends we had a couple of things and stay tuned to watch how it went your party mazima that was its name mall being along in zambia it's along gava road when you get to the mall the party is just opposite it and you won't miss it it's like a grass thatched um entrance About four of us ordered for the continental breakfast, which had basically bread, lots of bread. Um, you don't need to go through all those details, but I see a butter bun and slice of bread, or toast and croissant, or au pain with chocolat, butter and jam, two eggs of your choice, and English bacon, a slice of artisan cooked ham, or smoked turkey and cheese. One of us ordered for the full breakfast, although I don't remember seeing all these things. They say the fresh salad, I swear I didn't see any salad. <laughs> I saw the fruit juice, um, it came with a yogurt, I think I tasted one of the chicken sausages, I think I prefer beef sausages. And so those are the two breakfasts we ordered for. The Continental was 24500 the full breakfast was 38900 Three of us ordered for the sandwich. I ordered for the barbecue sandwich. So I'll link the menu in the description so that you can all see. We ordered for ice cream. The ice cream is 7,000 a scoop. And then we headed over to La Gourmet. I don't know if it's La Gourmet or La Gourmet. But yeah, it's, uh, it's more like a supermarket. So it has lots of um, stuff you can get. There's basically everything you could find in a supermarket. It has a cheese and organic food section. So knock yourself out if you ever go shopping. And then we got offered free coffee, um, which is nice. I really love the coffee and I'm not a coffee person. They say it was hazelnut flavored and it was awesome. So go buy their coffee, that I will recommend. It also has a sitting area, which we took really nice photos. Um, if you follow me, oh, no, I didn't post them anywhere, but yeah. Um, Generally, they were nice. You can either choose to sit inside the supermarket, like if you're alone, it would be a nice secluded place to, to like chill by yourself with a book, as someone said. 
And yeah, that that's it for La Patisse Hagi. So it's a pretty chill place. It has a supermarket, it has a restaurant area, um, it has a shop. I think the shop is for like furniture and interior decor. And I've seen a pantry where you can get like different types of wines. And uh, I've seen like a store for an artist, so maybe you can go buy. I've seen mainly masks. I didn't record any of that, so I hope you can just come and visit the place. All in all, the food was, to be honest, I would give it mediocre, a mediocre rating. Uh, the bread was a little bit too dry. I don't know if it was just mine, but in a way it was fine because it was soft on the inside, but I just didn't like that the outside of the, the bread was a bit too crunchy. Um, it's just like the right amount of people for me, not too many, not too few. Uh, there's chill music in the background, I don't know if you can hear it. And uh, I had a chicken sandwich. It was 30. Okay, the total I spent was 33, but it should be around 22,000. 22, 22,000. 22, um, I had that and a hot chocolate. The hot chocolate was average as well. I think I, I might have had better out there, so I can't really tell. Apart from um, my meal, let's see, my friends ordered for continental breakfast and I will just write down whatever is in the menu. Down there. And from what I had, the food was bland. So, yeah, I don't think this is a very, like, good place you can come and experience the food like don't come with all your eagerness and I used to think the proportions were quite you know it was little food not that I didn't get satisfied I actually got satisfied with like the first um, slice so uh, in general I would recommend this place if you want like a chill Sunday morning to come and you know have a special time with your friends and uh, yeah that's all I can say for now. Thank you. And you can see my next videos. I'll try and upload more now since I, I'm not sure I'm back in the mood to upload. But you can check out in a couple of weeks. I hope to be uploading every two weeks. So check in my next video. For more of such content, um, you can see.